What up, everyone? Crypto Marxist, aka Bone Army, coming at you. So, I have great news about the Shiboshis. Shiboshis sold out. So, of course, you guys know there was three different phases in the rollout of the Shiboshis. There was one for phase one was for the Shiboshi holders. That's S H I Boshis. And of course, they're partnered with a she, like female, she Boshis. So if you were a Shiboshi holder, you could claim a Shiboshi. Phase two was leash holders claiming Shiboshis or being able to buy Shiboshis. And then phase three, basically the public sell. So that being said, let's go ahead and check out how the Shiboshis are doing right now. So we're going to check um, CoinGecko. Why am I going to check CoinGecko? Well, here, let's go ahead and slide over to CoinGecko. Once again, I go by Crypto Marxist, aka Bone Army, coming at you. If you like hearing about the Shiba Inu ecosystem, go ahead and hit that sub, hit that like, bell it up because some of my stuff is time sensitive and urgent. All right, cool. So, top ERC 404 coins by market cap. Okay, so by market cap, the current leader is Pandora. Why is Pandora the leader? Well, they were the first mover. And that is big when it comes to that. Current price is 16532 up 7.8% over the past seven days. Okay, so this is a big market cap. Keep in mind, $165 million. Okay, that's the market cap. But look at the 24-hour volume, $7.2 million. The number two, currently number two, Defrogs, sitting at 761 Point fifty seven. Full disclosure: sold my defrog and purchased a sh another Shiboshi. Okay, because that's how bullish I am in this ecosystem. So just full disclosure. So um, up eighteen point one percent. And the reason why defrogs are so banger, and I do like that project, is because they were the first uh, profile pictures. Okay, that were four hundred four. So of course, once again, first movers. Okay. So with that said. Their volume sitting at 1 million, okay? So we have the number one uh, in terms of 24-hour volume in, in the top ERC 404 coins by market cap, right? So the 24-hour volume sitting at 7.2 for the leader, Pandora. $1 million, 24-hour volume for Defrogs with a $7.6 million market cap. All right, cool. Now... Let's go ahead and check out the Shiboshis. Let's check out their chart. See what the chart is looking like real quick. So right now, according to Dex Tools, they're sitting at a total market cap of $8.64 million. All right, so $8.64 million. And let's check their 24-hour volume. 24-hour volume sitting at $1.55 million. So that's $1.55 million and $8.6 million market cap. So then you have defrogs right now. So tomorrow, if the APIs and everything is in order, this should update. Keep in mind, I'm just I'm giving you the latest. So they haven't updated it. Okay. So tomorrow, expect that. Okay. It is $8.6 million. So Shiboshi's currently the number two ranked in terms of market cap and the number two in terms of 24 hour volume. Okay, so just something for you guys to keep in mind. So I don't know exactly how the ERC 404s react in terms of the market cap in on ocean, uh, open sea. Okay, so. I was able to snap one up at 360 something, okay? So then I'm like, well, maybe they'll go down, okay, if there's a dip in the market cap, right? But is it related, right? Because you can see right now there is a little pullback, right? You see this pullback. So I was expecting this pullback to actually hit around here, probably hit this right here. Hold up for this one. Oh, keep in mind, this right now is super degen. Uh, this is the one-minute chart. So don't think of this as some kind of high 
technical analysis. This is just me actually trying to ride this chart and see if uh, if the NFTs actually roll out quicker as well. I mean, dip down as well. Okay, so that being said, here, let's go ahead and hit this just real quick. Okay, where we're at. Okay, because the base was at about 360 or so, right? It was about 315, 319 when it started to go. So this is what I'm expecting the floor to actually be at, okay? Keep in mind, I snapped mine up before they were released publicly just because I wasn't sure what the price was going to be. Of course, when it comes to airdrops, you know that there is normally a sell-off, but because there's going to be so much um, buy pressure coming in, that's what I expect. Um, I do expect the Shiboshis to be range around four to eight hundred dollars. Keep in mind, this right now would be at eight hundred thirty dollars if there was only ten thousand total market cap. I mean, total supply. Unfortunately, some of the um, hiccup that occurred, the snafu, allowed minting to occur before the claims. I believe that's what they're saying right now. So that increased altogether the supply to 20,000. But with that said, I'm extremely bullish on it, but wanted to tell you, so it's at 417, go back to um, OpenSea. And the cheapest one right now is at probably the, uh, the peak, the recent peak at $457. Okay. So 450, oh snap, hold up. Just in case you didn't see that, let me go back. I don't, I don't know if I shared that. So right here, going to the, to this one right here, bop, you got this. It's at $457, all right? $457, all right, cool. So swing back. All right, so if that dips down, will these dip down? I have no idea if they will dip down. Just keeping that in mind because, once again, these are experimental new types of NFTs, which are essentially coins and NFTs at the same time. But these particular ones are, t are I guess, first movers as well because they, these are the first DN404s that I'm aware of, okay? So with that said, let's go ahead and check the chart one more time. Right now, I actually, I expect a type of reversal right here, actually, to probably about four, to about 440 or so, probably spike up a little bit, to about 430, 438, and then probably keep trending downward. Let's see if it actually reverses, because right now it's a downward trend, but it's so early, like I said, so expect, obviously, a pullback. But I see about 419 to about 313 being the main range that you guys should focus on. I don't see it going back to 319. In fact, if it even goes to 380, of course, not financial advice, 380, I would say that might be a good entry for some of you guys if you're looking to participate in the Shiboshi experiment. All right. So with that said, Crypto Marxists, aka Bone Army, just came at you. Just giving you a little analysis. Don't, um, not financial advice. Keep in mind, this is the one minute chart. It's so young. It's so young right now. You know, it's hard to even give actual analysis. But because the project, in my opinion, the Shiboshis will be tied to the metaverse. It's a no brainer. Okay. They're going to have their own lands. They're going to have, uh, events most likely so even the nfts when they release i believe they're gonna have pictures of the metaverse in the background what am i talking about all right cool i was gonna move on but let me just go ahead and hit you with this article that i haven't even read yet but look at these okay so you have like a jungle you have like a cherry blossom japanese type setting you have like some ruins so what I'm saying is these could be the backgrounds, okay? Of course, I'm only speculating, but putting that out there. But these look like parts of the metaverse, okay? So just putting that out there, okay? Who, who knows what 
will happen. We do know that with the Shiboshis, there was a land airdrop that occurred. I missed it. That's why I was so adamant about telling you guys, look, if you have a Shiboshi, get your Shiboshi partner, okay? Don't miss the airdrop. So I hope I, I helped a couple people with that to get their Shiboshi. But if history repeats, there was a Shiboshi airdrop for land, maybe there'll be a Shiboshi airdrop. For, uh, I'm just speculating, just putting it out there, because this project is so new. And of course, the Shiba Inu ecosystem is going to be, in my opinion, one of the leading, most dominant in the field of cryptocurrency. In fact, I believe Decentraland is going to run the billboards in the metaverse. Now, don't quote me on that, but I believe that's what I heard. Okay, so there's a lot going on. Imagine that partnership. So don't forget, they also have a partnership with K9 Token and K9 Token also dropping on March 7th. Okay, so I'm gonna drop a video for you guys as well. And don't think I forgot about bad idea. Okay, I'm gonna definitely do a update on that on the Twitter on the uh, price chart and all that good stuff. So with that said, Crypto Marxist, a.k.a. Bone Army, just came at you. Give you a little something on the Shiboshis. Let's go back to the chart just to see what the chart is doing, if it's still dipping or is it reversing like I said it was about to do. And it looks like it is actually about to start reversing like I expected it to do. In fact, a lot of people don't even know the Shiboshis are out yet. Okay, Keep in mind, we are in a crypto bubble. We were expecting it, part of the airdrop and all that stuff. But for those people that might not know, let them know that the Shiboshis, if you are as bullish as I am, let them know Shiboshis sold out and um, it's looking like they're going to go to the moon, okay, as one of the premier 404 tokens in the space. Top ERC 404 currently right now. It's not even updated right now. Defrogs, all due respect to Defrogs because I was an owner of a Defrog. And now I had to get rid of it because I already know, all right, Shiboshis is where it is at. So with that said, I appreciate y'all. Crypto Marxist, aka Bone Army, just came at you. If you want more, go ahead and hit that sub, hit that like, bell it up because some of my stuff is time sensitive and urgent or catch some of those videos right there. Appreciate y'all. I'm out. Deuces.